Meditative and quietly provocative, Larry Day was an artist who made an impact on the field of American art with his unique voice. He was born in 1921 in North Philadelphia to a first-generation Italian family. He spent most of his life in the region. From the late 1930s until his death in 1998, Day was a prolific painter, draftsman, and printmaker. In the tradition of Thomas Aikens and Arthur B. Carls, Day was a naturally devoted teacher. This devotion led him to be known as the Dean of Philadelphia Painters. I was in awe of him, as were most of the students. He just wanted to be in his class. Generations of artists were impacted through the example of his work, through the thoughtfulness of his practice, and innate generosity. He was clearly a major influence by way of his kind of personal resolve with regard to his own work and his, um, his pedagogical style, the way he formed sentences, you know, and, and this, uh, his verbal uh, cadence, it tended to um, stick. It tended to lock into your awareness. Decades later, many of his students have reported their continuing gratitude for Day's generosity and for encouraging them to think independently. He had a very intellectual approach to, to talking about painting. I would say, as a very young person back then, he was one of the first people who I think I responded to through a more intellectual kind of association with what painting is about. Day's work was included in many exhibitions through the 1960s and 70s that charted a new path for figurative arts. This legacy led to his work being referred to as ironic realism, a moniker he appreciated. I am a realist up to a point, that is, uh, I use relative norms. Everything is sort of recognizable, but in fact, they're not imitations of uh, figures or places or, or things. They are comments on or aspects, attitudes toward or illuminations of. And so as a result, I, I want a certain amount of um, distancing between the image and the thing that is being represented. He had to engage with the social dimension of art in a different way. He had to speak in his voice as an artist through this lens of art as an intellectual undertaking. Larry Day is a deeply introspective figure that, you know, if Jackson Pollock is showing himself in the garage throwing paint, you know, Larry Day shows himself in the basement of his home at a drafting table, deeply introspective, you know, immersed in the thinking process of making art. And it's that questioning of assumptions, it's that sense of what you see is not the full story, that there's always something more. Those are the questions that I get out of Larry Day. Today, Day's work reminds us to slow down, to look, to listen, and to think deeply about our individual journeys and our shared future. So we need slowness. We need everything that is deliberate, thoughtful. And um, I think Larry is one of those uh, individuals, those commitment and dedication to that kind of thinking. And you can see that quite clearly in his painting.
Thank you.